What's up, pictures from the family? It's your boy Jay. And Nipa. And we're here with the Wendy's Breakfast Mug Bang. Yep. Wendy's Breakfast. So, the 199. Y'all know y'all seen on commercials and stuff. So, we got two a piece. And also, we're doing the marriage license challenge. Marriage license challenge. Because this is something we just come up with. We just came up with. Because it's a lot of people. It's a lot of people. They say they married. They say they married, but they ain't married. Show us the proof. Feel me? I know you don't have to, but a lot of these people like, oh, I'm married and this and that and that and that. So we doing the hashtag certificate marriage license on how are we gonna put it? Mm -hmm. Hashtag married. Hashtag married. Okay. So let's get started. Let's eat. Cause right. I'm ha, 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 Good hungry. Lord, Father, we thank you, Lord, for the food I received. All that no shine by the shrimp. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. And we got a strawberry lemonade here. Ooh. It's chicken. The girl with the two ponytails. It's Sausage. not chickens. It's one sausage, one bacon, I think. Oh, uh, they put. Uh, no. I believe they the croissant. The sausage. It's a sausage, and then the other oh, one. Oh, this is sausage. The other one is a bacon, I believe. Oh, I'm gonna say sausage. But... They all better not be sausage, cause I told him. Told him what? No, it's bacon. That's okay. bacon. And bacon, one sausage. No, we got two of them because you know, look how. Like, look how small that is. You feel me? But you don't need too much for breakfast. Just need a little fuel. Wanna do a thumbnail? Mm-hmm. Wanna do a cool thumbnail. Oh, you can smell the syrup. I love bacon. Two strips of bacon, y'all. Two strips, wow. Two little strips of bacon. Ready? See, go. Yum, yum, yum. All right. And then look at yours. See if we got two pieces of bacon. Two little pieces of bacon. And the egg. Well, thank you, Lord, for this. In Jesus' name, man. But yeah, man. Make sure you like, subscribe, comment, hit that bell, be notified. We waiting for guys. It is free. You got napkins in the bag. Yep. Mm -hmm. Got enough. That's the one right here. So yeah, y'all. We Ooh. will we'll think about it because there's a lot of people on Say YouTube. Say they married. So we watch all type of other YouTubers. My wife, my husband. Mm -mm. My wife, my husband, but oh, I'm going to leave him and this and that. I'm going to leave her. Cheating pranks. Right. Mm -mm. Don't play over here. Leave I believe Damien and Bianca married. I you, believe, you that. believe that. In the way I believe it. I think they did go to the courthouse and did the rest of it. Mm -hmm. Tom and Corey, they not married. And another thing too, another thing I be thinking about like Joel and uh, Lauren, they're married, but, whew. but, how, how, I guess, how I'm trying to explain it. Um, it's like, why, why I look at, I like, I be looking at a lot of people like, wow, they living a married life, doing all this successful everything. But it's like it take the fun out of marriage. That's kick ass scratching on the door, going crazy. But you shouldn't stop yet. Nope. Y'all can see what this cat doing. <laughs> She's just like, like you know, how you do the um, the the boxing bag, speed bag. What was she doing to the window? She's down the legs long. You know, she mad. She like, we got fun in the car. I'm in the car. I gave you snacks. That's why I told you coming in it. because she was crawling all over the car while we in it. And you're taking the lady. Getting set up and she was taking the light in the way. Plus, you tried to open it up. The cat literally with the handle. Went under the handle and trying to pull it. 
Like, how do you do that? Mm. This cat craze. Mm. But yeah. I know a lot of people gonna be like, so what? So this and that, da da da. People don't fail to realize. Remember, God created marriage. People come up with all kind of challenges, so why we can't come up with this? Show your marriage, show your own marriage license challenge. Hashtag marriage. Hashtag marriage. And my wife is always us. When we get married, watch God bless us. Because it's like, I know a lot of people don't want to hear this. We be shacking. It's the truth. We be shacking. We be living like we married, living with our baby mamas or baby daddies for what? They've been together for 10 years, ain't married. Like, we ain't gonna get married. Like, doing everything married people do having kids, living together, cooking, cleaning, paying the bills. That's why when it comes down to commitment, then it's like, probably did it all. Another thing, ladies, you gotta make these men, man, you gotta make these men like, if you want me, hey, if, if I ain't with this back and forth stuff, it's like, you on, you on, you, you want me or not? But like, like I said, man, people wonder why, people wonder why they get sick. Because we've been in fornication. The women don't want to commit as much as the men don't want to commit nowadays, so. I'm not perfect. It's just the things that God deal with me with. You feel me? So, <coughs> we're not perfect, but we strive for perfection. When they say you know better, you do better. Mm -hmm. Well, it comes down to your decision. You want to please man or you want to please God? That's good. It is good. Which was better, this or the sausage? Sausage or the bacon? Sausage. Sausage. It's way better. Then again. Have you showed my marriage life? Not yet. I ain't, I ain't forget. Oh, I'm going to show you before this video ends. Matter of fact. I had to look at it. To make sure. I wasn't exposing some, you know, information. Information, yeah. yeah. Like social security and stuff like that. But it ain't that now. This is our marriage license. Mm-mm-mm. You know y'all can see it not. And it's approved, but show them the stamp. Because people are like, oh, they probably put it really not together. Dead County, baby. Joe County building. Marriage. Certificate. And you didn't give me the information. Some people put it inside of a frame. Some people don't. But this is how they gave it to us, yeah. like this. We're we'll officially married. But like I said, man, God gonna bless you so much. Remember, God created marriage. March 14th, 2014. March 14, 2014. <laughs> on the 14th. Wow. Yeah. Mm. How long do I got the car? I'm a grown woman. Who got some on with me? Beyonce. Yeah. Beyonce, something. In the song. middle of the street. She said, I'm a grown woman. I can do whatever I want. Yep. Yeah. That's a question I wanted to know from the ladies, from the women. What makes you a grown woman? Hmm. In your own words, in my words, what makes you a grown woman is um having a baby is in in a sense makes you a woman. Um, That's part of womanhood. Yeah. Um, well, well, not not to say because what about those who can't have kids? I want to finish. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. Let me shut up. Um, paying your bills, 
doing your own like doing adult adult things responsibility paying bills um I guess paying bills and paying your own bills taking care of your body I guess I don't, I don't really know I dropped my nephew. Oh, you get that. Paying your bills, having a baby. I want to say for the young ladies. Um, having mm -hmm. your menstrual. When you have your menstrual, becoming a woman. I think that's what makes you a woman. Is when you have a menstrual, you become a woman. Like you can have a baby. You get what I'm saying? Well, it makes you grown, pay your own bills and being responsible like that. Mm -hmm. Paying your own bills and, excuse me, being responsible. Mm -hmm. And you got some women, you got some ladies out here who have kids, but don't take care of them properly. What about going to the club and stuff like that? Club days are over for me. I don't even care about the club. Like I can, I can make my own club in my own house. I don't, I don't think clubs are the same no more. No, nah, it ain't the same. It's like every time you go, especially like where we from. It's okay. Every time somebody get together, there's always something going on. Somebody said something. Somebody looked at me like this. People getting shot on looks. I think. I think clubs are more like. Um, somebody I watched on YouTube. She went to like a hookah lounge. Okay. Ooh, she turned the blinds up. She know what she doing. Excuse me. I'm going to karaoke. There's nothing wrong with that. When you go to karaoke, I think they're changing the game as far as club. The club, to me, was just going and dancing music loud. Meeting people and stuff yeah. like that. And mm -hmm. <laughs> Boy, I remember the club days. Boy, we go out there, ears be ringing, you come out the club like, <laughs> like I, it was crazy back then, though. Then when you come out, you know, I've been in there so long, you'd be like, oh, man. Like you, like you, like you was a in a time castle. Like, in a zombie. like you was in a time castle. Like you was just stuck in time. But you had the best time in your life. And oh, man, that was crazy. Mm, all this sweaty, stinky men all up on and you. Especially when they, like, before, before this R. Kelly situation, they, boy, you gonna hear some R. Kelly inside the club, boy. Yep, the club just be jumping. Back in my day. Chocolate, chocolate factory day when they play that thing. Oh man, everybody boy. You gonna have booty everywhere. <laughs> That's crazy. Boy, it was, it was crazy though, boy. <laughs> now crazy. look what's called it's causing him his life now. Yeah. And, and it's crazy about that part. Like all that stuff he was singing, he was really he was live singing this stuff what was happening. I ain't never know when I seen them. I looked at them and they're like, oh, Lord. Don't. I didn't believe it at first. So I, I thought it was like they trying to get money and all that. Man, this nigga really, this nigga really had a. My thoughts on that was first of all, why would uh, two parents, mother and father, sit, let their 16 or 17 year old daughter go to this man's concert? You know what this man sing about? That's like going to Trey Song's concert. Yeah, I know what he's singing about. Why would I let my 17-year-old daughter go to that kind of concert? Hmm. Right? Right. Then, you had some girls sneaking off, leaving school. They parents think they in school. They off over here at R. Kelly um, Hotel. Sure. So, a lot of it was the kids, them girls' fault. 
by knowing, oh, they was a kid, but they made that decision. They easily made to mind. manipulate. When you young like yeah. that, they very easy to manipulate. Not only that, <coughs> if I'm 17, right? Check this out. Y'all, come on, y'all. Y'all tell me if I'm right or wrong. Girl, that's R. Kelly. What if I get a baby from R. Kelly? Girl, I'll be set for life. I'll be straight. Huh. Tell me if I'm right or wrong, y'all. Come on. Let me hear it. Let me hear it in the comment section. See, and, and another thing too, though. Let me hear it. All type of STDs. They don't thinking about that. They, they don't push that no more. They don't push about AIDS and HIV no more. They look at that rapper, them young girls thinking about setting their future up. If I get a baby, if I get pregnant from them, I'll be straight. Same thing with football players and basketball players. Girl, if I can get him. In my hotel room, or if I can get in his hotel room, if I can just get a baby from him, hmm. you said you straight. Well, at least for 18 e years, e but e still. Evil intentions, dog. Evil intentions. I, I thought like <clears throat> girls, females think like that. I'm a female. I know what I'm talking about. We think like that. Girl, if I can get a baby from him, mm. Even if he ain't got no money, but he the neighborhood finest dude. Girl, if I can get him, I want a baby from him, girl. He fine. And what about your baby come out looking like Shrek? What? Fine. <laughs> I'm, being funny. I'm being funny, though. Y'all yeah, yeah. better think. Man, look. It ain't about sex. It ain't about ladies. babies. It ain't about money. Young ladies. It's more to life. Go to your education, man. Just make sure Don't you Don't worry about these first. dudes in school, man. And worry about these dudes in school. Get your education. Do what you got to do. Same thing for the young men. Don't worry about these little females, man. Don't worry about them. They're going to be there. I'm telling you. They're going to be there. Just go ahead. Do finish school. Date to marry. Don't just date just to date. Date to marry. she pretty or she fine. Oh, she got good hair. My baby. <sighs> Oh, he got good hair, so my baby, I have some good hair. Man, I, I'm blessed, man. Me, me personally. It's a lot of people out here think like that. That dude fine. He got some nice hair. My baby, I have nice hair. And baby come out with some greater hair down to your grandma. Oh, that was that nappy root hair. You be like, oh, man. I done seen mixed people, mixed kids with nappy hair. And they the ones with the pretty decent hair, you know? But yeah. Nice. Thank y'all for watching. We ain't gonna hold y'all no longer. We know this video was kind of here and there, but and we just put this video together today, today. right now. Like we right had now, no content. This is Friday that. morning. I have to be to work at 9:30. It is 8:51. Who show y'all? Speed break. It is 8:51 here, right now. Today's date is uh, September 10th. Y'all gonna get this. September 10th. Yeah, it's in I'm a little while, y'all right gonna now. get this. Jason finna go put his work in so y'all can see this video. We love y'all. We thank y'all for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment down below because I want to hear y'all comments. And if the you know the, the comment section back. And if y'all new to our channel and you haven't subscribed yet, come here. Come here. What you waiting for? It's, it's free. free. See y'all in the next video. Bye.